in this question uh, we have to make a box with a square base that means if the length is x width is also x square base and no top there is no top so only five sides the bottom the area of the bottom is x square and area of each side is x times y here x times y so x y four of them and 1200 square inch of material is available that square inch that goes on the surface area so the constraint in this case constraint the relationship between the variables is the area 1200 surface area so area of the bottom is x square area of each side is x y and four of them so 4 x y equals 1200 and we want to solve this constant for one variable uh, x in two places y alone so let's solve for y subtract x square from both sides and divide by 4x so that gives us y equals 1200 minus x square over 4x now next is the objective function the function that we want to maximize or minimize in this case uh, maximize the volume of the box so we want to maximize the volume find the dimensions that length we need to find length width and height so the volume v as a function of x let's say because we are expressing y as a function of x so v volume is length times width times height so x times x times y x times x x is square y and that's x is square times y is given as 1200 minus x square over 4x so x square times everything now we can cancel uh, one x from top and bottom and that leaves just x and we can multiply the top that x times 1200 1200 x minus x times x squared x cubed over 4 separate into two variables 1200 x over 4 that's uh, 1200 over uh, 3 4 is 300 x minus x cubed over 4 which is the same as 1 fourth x cubed that's the objective function now we want to maximize this one in any case to maximize or minimize we find the derivative okay let's say now the derivative is uh, 300 minus 1 fourth times 3x squared 1 fourth times 3x squared and we set the derivative 0 and solve for x uh, let's move 300 over so negative 1 fourth times 3x square we could have multiplied uh, that would be negative 3 fourths move 300 over negative 300 now that implies x is square equals negative 300 so we have negative 3 fourths on the left we multiply by negative 4 thirds on the right Okay, 3 on the top goes on the bottom 4 on the bottom goes to the top negative negative uh, multiply positive 3 goes 300 100 times so 400 so x square equals 400 so x equals plus minus 20 uh, these are just length so we take just positive value so x equals 20 so x equals 20 and y equals 20 sorry <coughs> length is 20 with 20 and the height we can find from the constraint that's the answer now the question is why x equals 20 maximize the volume for that we find the second derivative uh, here is the first derivative derivative of 300 is 0 minus this is 3 fourths minus 3 fourths times derivative of x square 2x that's in fact 2 goes for 2 times so negative 3 halves x 
that's the second derivative now we want to evaluate this second derivative at x equals 20 okay uh, v double prime second derivative at 20 when we plug in x equals 20 we're gonna get negative now, I don't <coughs> need the value all I need is sign so it's negative that implies v the function second derivative negative means negative at 20 means the function v is maximum v is v has a maximum value okay v has maximum v has max value at 20 and we plug in x equals 20 here to get y then y equals just plug in, in your calculator 20 square 400 1200 minus 400 800 divided by 4 times 20 80 so 800 divided by 80 that's 10 thus the dimensions are x times x times y that's 20 feet uh, inch 20 inch by 20 inch by height 10 inch 